Representative James Clyburn SC, the number three Democrat in the House, expressed alarm at recent reports that Russia is trying to meddle in the 2020 election. Clyburn, the House Majority Whip, told Greta Van Susteren in an interview set to air on Sunday that he's had concerns about interference from Moscow since before the 2016 election, when U.S. intelligence agencies, the Senate Intelligence Committee and information reported by former special counsel Robert Mueller found that the country unleashed a complex disinformation campaign on social media and attempted to hack U.S. election databases. I have been very concerned about that, and I have been for a long, long time, he said on full court press with Greta Van Susteren. I always believed that the Russians have been at this for a long time. Clyburn underscored South Carolina's 2010 Senate race in which Democrat Alvin Michael Green bested the party's chosen candidate in a primary and was ultimately trounced in the general election. Something went wrong in this primary. People dismissed it, he said. I say again, there is something going wrong not just in these presidentials, but there's some things happening in these primaries all over the country. The remarks come after intelligence reports emerge that Russia is attempting to take efforts to boost the campaigns of President Trump Donald John Trump Where do we go from here? Conservation can show the way Gov. Ron DeSantis more popular in Florida than Trump Sotomayor accuses Supreme Court of bias in favor of Trump administration more and Senator Bernie Sanders IVT. Sanders confirmed Friday he had been briefed on Moscow's plans a month ago. We have the most productive, the most admired democracy in the world, and it is getting under a lot of countries' skins, and they are doing whatever they can to disrupt, to sow discord, to do whatever they can to make it look as if democracy cannot work, said Clyburn. And for me as a descendant of slaves to sit here and say this democracy is worth preserving. Sanders has hammered Russian President Vladimir Putin since the news emerged, saying he is no friend of Moscow's leader. I don't care, frankly, who Putin wants to be president. Sanders said in a statement Friday. My message to Putin is clear, stay out of American elections, and as president I will make sure that you do. Trump has dismissed claims Russia is working to boost his re-election effort, calling the news a democratic-led misinformation campaign. Another misinformation campaign is being launched by Democrats in Congress saying that Russia prefers me to any of the do-nothing Democrat candidates who still have been unable to, after two weeks, count their votes in Iowa, Trump said, referring to delayed results from the Iowa caucuses.